Hello there. You know, I just, I just had to make this video one last time. And this is the last time that I think I'm going to touch on this topic. I think I touched on this topic a couple of days ago. First and foremost, if I see a video that caught my attention, I go on that person page and I scroll, right? I scroll to see what it is that they may be facing or they may be going through. I don't just go on that one video and touch and judge off of that. You understand what I'm saying? I just had a comment and the comment stated that um, they asked the question. And the question was, do I not have any friends or family? Because they feel like people on the internet, you know, they're lonely. Now, if you go back through the video a couple of days ago, you will see that I'm never alone. I'm okay. I might want to get out and be around people, but I am fine within myself because I know how to be content within this, right? I don't have to pick up the phone and call and get other people's thoughts and their opinions to make my decisions in my own brain. That's how strong I am within myself. I don't have to do that. I am my own best friend. I have best friend. I have friends that I can call. I have family members. I have all of these things. But I'm so content with being by myself that it feels so good that if I just don't feel like picking up the phone and calling and I want to make a video to help other people or I want to make a video because other people may be experiencing the same thing I, I am, then that's just what I, I'm going to do. What people fail to realize is the universe is a give and take situation. It's not a be stingy situation. Your life is to be shared because you are a creation of the creator. Am I, can I get an amen or not? So in my life, I am creating. I've had two children that passed away. And with this pregnancy, I am trying to document certain points of my own life and my own journey because this is part of my own creation. So that's what I'm doing. If the radio is just too much frequency to your ears, you can always scroll up and don't have to listen. It's just that simple in life. We don't have to go around asking questions and doing things like that. You know, you can say congratulations or you can say things like, oh my God, this is beautiful. You know, you can say so many things versus a person is lonely because baby, if you look at me and look at my page, I'm never alone. My kids can go outside for literally five hours and I could be sitting in this mother in my own thoughts, laughing to my own self, breathing the air that I breathe with no problems, no issues and no nothing around me. I'm okay with that. Most people can't be okay with that. They got to pick up the phone and be like, hey, let me tell you what's going on with me today. Oh my God, I had such and such happen to me today. Oh my God, girl, let me tell you about this. Let me tell you about that. I'm not one of those people that do that. Never have been, never will be. I can sit with my own thoughts. If I'm having an issue, I can sit with my own self. Again, most people can't do that. Most people can't talk to themselves because they feel crazy. I talk to myself because I don't feel crazy. I talk to myself because I know that all the answers that I need to my life and my problems are within me. And if I feel stuck, then I sit still in my own thoughts. I may pick up the phone and call a family member if it's a little too tough and I might need your advice or opinion on something. I may do that. But for the most part, I sit and I think because I am a thinker and I am a problem solver. And I know that I can solve my own problems in majority of the ways of my life. Now, I'm sorry if most can't do that. I can help you try to understand how to, but I, I can do it. And that's what I do. And I'm okay with that. And guess what? When it all blows over, I sit back and I laugh. Drink me some water. Drink me some tea. I don't like lemonade because it gives me heartburn. <laughs> but today is Sunday. And I don't feel like having a clap back. I'm so feeling so. I feel like all of my chakras right now are so balanced. That's literally how I feel. I feel good today. I feel good. That's why the way that I'm going, I'm not going to respond the way that 
a person want me to respond. I'm not going to do what a person wants me to do because I just don't feel like it. Now, on Monday, I might do a little clap back because that's just what I do. I clap back. My clap back game is hard as hell. But today, I just want to be at peace and positivity. I don't feel like it. And when you know yourself and when you talk to yourself and when you sit with your own thoughts without picking up the phone, calling people to get their thoughts in their own brain because you got your own. You can do that. <laughs> you can do that. I'm never alone. I got me. I have my children. And if they're gone, like right now they're sleeping, it's me with my own thoughts. And I feel like expressing it on a video. Because guess what? I'm going to always have something to come back and remember. I could write it down. I don't feel like it. Because there's other people out there that's just like me. And that is simply okay. It is okay. So I hope that this answer any of you questions. And um, yeah, remember, you can get pregnant at 37. Even if you feel like you can't, you can. And always remember that they have herbs out there for you. Yanni steams, you can start doing Yanni steams. You can, if you have fibroids or cysts, you can start, um, you know, doing, like I said, Yanni steams. It's another thing called castor oil you can put on your body. Soursop leaves. Is so many different things. You have chlorophyll. Um, you have oregano. You have so many things out here that can help you conceive. You don't have to listen to a doctor because they only go off a book. This is your body and your experience, and it's ways to rid any diseases. It's raised to is ways to rid any tumors or any type of cyst on the ovaries i remember i had a cyst it was five centimeter cyst on my ovaries two weeks later it was gone and you want to know what i drank kombucha and i've also had another tea a gallon of it with other herbs in it i think it was oak straw stuff like that it's things that you can do it's things that you can do so yes this video was specifically made to let everyone know no i'm not alone i have me i have me and I have the universe guiding me and my creator. And I know that I am a creation of the creator. And I know that I am here, sent on this earth to express myself. Most people can't grasp that. And most people don't understand that. And they don't understand why I do certain things that I do. Or why certain content creators do the things that they do. They sit there and judge them. They sit there and ask silly questions. And they sit there and feel like, oh, well, she shouldn't be saying that my life is my life and your life is your life and what you would do i won't and what i would do you won't i'm glad we have this mutual understanding i see y'all a little later on because i have to get up and go eat something because i'm starving enjoy y'all day <laughs>